Hi, my name is Trissa, and this is day five of the movie night pajama sew along. Today we are just doing the main construction of our bottoms, so you don't need your elastic, waistband, or cuffs at this time. You only need your right and left leg piece. We are so going to start off by taking one of our leg pieces, mashing it up right sides together with the end of the crotch and the bottom of the pant leg, and go ahead and pin that together. Go ahead and repeat that for the other pant leg. Now with both legs pinned, go ahead and sew up your inseam with a 3 8 of an inch seam allowance and then come back. With both inseams sewn, go ahead and take one of your pant legs and flip it right side out. Now you're going to take that leg and you're going to put it inside of the other leg so they are right sides together matching up the inseams. When I sew up my crotch curve, I like to nest my inseams together. So that means that one seam is going to be pointing to the left and one side is going to be pointing to the right. You can see here, they kind of nest together rather than having both seams on one side and it being really bulky. This helps um, reduce the bulk um, and it helps create a good um, point there. So go ahead and nest that and put a pin in it. And I like to put a pin at matching up the top and the bottom and then continuing pinning the rest of the way. Now with your crotch curve pinned, go ahead and sew that up again with a 3 8 of an inch seam allowance and then come back. I like to have my, um, I like to sew on the inside like this with kind of how I do with everything else with the foot going inside. I just feel like it helps a little bit. And my machine is getting my, I think I need a new, um, cut knife because my knife does not like to go over thick things so I have to help it along on seams currently. Now with your crotch curve sewn, go ahead and turn your pants right side out. And it should look something like this. And after that, that is all that we are doing today. To stay up to date on future videos, please subscribe to my channel. You can also view more on my blog at sewingandthings.com.